I'm put up with changes Come pick me up cause I just wanna see the light so if you're a tech enthusiast and an avid surface user like me it's highly likely that you're excited about the new windows 11 update they have basically adapted this whole class morphism look and today we're gonna recreate that look in adobe xd i'm gonna walk you through it step by step so even if you have never used a prototyping software before you'll be able to follow along before we get started i want to install windows 11 myself and get a closer look at the new ui Not gonna lie, I'm already in love with this look. Alright, moving on, let's open up Adobe XD. It's a free software and you can easily install it from the website. So once you open up Adobe XD, you'll get a couple of presets in front of you. Uh, select the web 1920 and let's get started. I have downloaded this Windows 11 wallpaper from the web and we'll use it as a background. Place the image onto your artboard and then lock the layer from the layers panel on the bottom left. You can also bring up the layers panel by pressing Ctrl plus Y. Press R to bring up the rectangle tool and create a rectangle and change the radius of the corner to 10 pixels. Now there's actually only two things you need to get a glass look that is add a shadow and a background blur. Select your rectangular and on your right you'll get both the options. You can adjust the parameters according to the look you want to create but for now I'm gonna leave the values to these. Microsoft has a proper documentation on Windows 11 design so you can study that as well and I'll leave a link to that down below. If you head over to the typography section, you can find the official font Sego and I'm gonna download and install it on my PC. Apart from the glass morphism look, I also really like the new navigations. These little bars are way too cute. So yeah, that's basically how you get a glassy look and to see how we can use this concept to design interesting UIs, I'm gonna try create a landing page for a cafe in glass morphism style. This cafe in Darjeeling has been my workspace for the last few weeks and I'll be taking them as a reference for our landing page design. I've sketched out a quick wireframe for the UI and let's get started. 